Welcome, welcome, Librans. Let's go. Let's see what's happening for you, Librans. This is a full moon of May. The full moon is on the 26th of May. It's a super, super full moon, Librans. All right. Let's get in this, Librans, and see what is happening. So we see the energy of the King of Pentacles. Who is this King of Pentacles? A lot of you are dealing with a Taurus, Virgo, or a Capricorn person. Who is this person? Hmm. All right, then we have the energy of the Knight of Pentacles. So a lot of you are dealing with a Taurus, Virgo, or a Capricorn person, okay? Both sun and moon sign. And remember, ladies and gentlemen, at the end, use um, or look for your sun sign, or if your moon sign, look for the link below. It is going to show you what timeline to find the moon or the sun sign, okay? First, we do a general so welcome if this is your first time this is a full moon all right so people are now recognizing who is the Taurus, Virgo, or capricorn man people are now um figuring out who is this person some sort of information is coming out about this man and i see the seven of wands um where a lot of you are going to be dealing with a young taurus Virgo, or capricorn man or woman in the third week light is going to be shedding so that is it. They're going to be recognizing who is a Taurus, Virgo, or a Capricorn man. So um, some of you could have been wondering who is this person? How is this person connected? A tower moment is coming down for a young Taurus, Virgo, or a Capricorn person, younger than 50 years old. Whatever this person has done, they are now recognizing what this person has done. In the fourth week, I see a lot of you are dealing with a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpion man. People are looking at this man um, and is recognizing who this man is and how this man is connected to some of you, Libran. Then we see the energy of the nine of ones where a lot of you need to protect yourself from a Pisces, Cancer, or Scorpion person, whoever this person is and whatever is happening. You got to protect yourself. You're too open to a Pisces, Cancer, or Scorpion man. Um, is it your husband? Is it your partner? Is it uh, um, uh, whoever this person is? Uh, a tower moment is going to be coming down on this person because some sort of a data and information is showing up this man and they're now finding out who this man is. So this full moon has to do with... Uh, um, you, some of you dealing with uh, maybe your husband that is a Taurus, Virgo, or a Capricorn, and a Pisces, Cancer, or Scorpion man. And they are recognizing the connection between these two people and recognizing who these two people are. Okay. And they're really recognizing and seeing the working of these two people and who they are. Hmm. We have been having really cold weather. It's like, one day it's sunny, one day it's cold, okay? When we're looking at a Taurus, Virgo, a Capricorn person, now, whoever this young man or woman is and whatever they have done, I see that people are now recognizing that this person have created a whole lot of problems, okay? And a huge tower moment is coming down and you Librans need to protect yourself, um, from this tower moment because they have recognized what this person have done. So I see a lot of you um, need to stand up to a Taurus, Virgo, or a Capricorn man because you're going to be recognizing and finding out um, a whole lot of data and information um, of, that this man had or has access and people are going to be finding out uh, what this man have done. Then um, people are now recognizing the truth of a young Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn person, and a tower moment is coming down for this person. Uh, this young Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn person have together worked with a uh, Pisces, Cancer, or Scorpion man and created a whole lot of problems and a whole lot of issue. And they're recognizing the collaboration between these two people. And a whole tower moment is going to be coming down on these two people because they recognize and see what they have done. So you're coming in in this full moon. Um, where some of you was in a relationship with the earth sign men, okay, earth sign men. Um, and for the young um, people between the ages of 18 and 50, it was as if it's your partner. 
whoever these people are and whatever is transpiring, you're going to be recognizing something about your husband, some sort of a connection um, with your husband or uh, ex-husband or whoever this person is coming up in your world to be. But this person it was some sort of a contract, contract that these two people have. You're leaving this full moon um, with the energy of the Five of Cups. And the energy of the Five of Cups is about um, regrets, regrets. And I see a scorpion man is going to be regretting what he have done. Because they are going to be picking up a scorpion man and recognizing that a scorpion man tried to create some sort of a problem and issues um, for a lot of you. Because uh, light is as if when the hermit comes in, the hermit is bringing and shedding light and letting you be aware that, it's, you know, who the person who has been working and blocking you and creating issues for you. And the tower moment is coming down, but it's not affecting you, Libran. It's affecting a scorpion man. And I see the scorpion man is going to be regretting what he have done. Because, uh, you know, it's as if you, Librans, could be saying, yeah, but, you know, this man is the man that asked me to do whatever. Or um, it could be your your boss, your supervisor, a, a team a team player, or someone from another company that has uh, accessed some sort of... Uh, um, information data and use you liberals to do that and they're going to be finding out okay for a lot of you liberals um information is going to be coming out that is going to um bring and uh, um and just flip things out um off site because uh, people are going to be recognizing what was happening. And it's as if a whole lot was kept from you liberals, and you're going to be finding out. All right, so I see sadness. Sadness is here for an older Taurus Virgo or Capricorn man. Sadness is here for a young, maybe this is your ex-husband or your child's father and your child sadness whatever has happened and has transpired i see a whole lot of sadness for these people these people are definitely family members like father and son uh, father and daughter um but these people are connected to a lot of you um and this father and son or father and daughter i see sadness for them sadness because uh, um something that they collaborated with in is now coming to light and i see a whole lot of sadness that they had collaborated together to create a whole lot of problems and issue then we see people are now recognizing uh who um you older ladies older ladies are going to be finding out what your husband and your child have done you older ladies could be finding out what your um your son father have done so you old ladies are going to be receiving some sort of information and data about what your son, father, and your son or daughter have done. And they're going to be recognizing that you older lady was not even aware. And I see you older ladies are going to be turning your back on your son or your son father because of some sort of a... Uh, situation they created for you in your life uh, you're going to be recognizing that is family members that had worked against you for some of you is your brother is a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn and his um, a daughter or um, his son that worked against a lot of you women and you older women is going to be recognizing that your son and his father had created some sort of an issue against you then light is going to be shedding on some sort of a health issue. Um, the health issue could be affecting you guys, but also it could be affecting your family. Thus, it could be um, health issues that you're, you were having could be ending because they find out what was creating this health issues. Health issues that your parents had could be leaving. Um, you older women had some sort of a health issue and they're going to be recognizing what was creating this health issue, okay? And um, a lot of you women are going to be 
if you if you like was sick and had some sort of a term well it's not really terminal illness you're going to be getting better it's as if they're going to be finding some sort of a cure or finding some way but i see you're going to be having a, a new lease on life okay i'm not a physician go check out your physician okay it's just something that is coming out then we see that they're recognizing that some of you um this could be your boss or a supervisor or a businessman, whether this person is this scorpion man or the spicy cancer or scorpion man. I see that some of you were to open or is as if some of you, your data or information was open and this man could have access your data and information. Is it a doctor? I see that a doctor could have access your data and information and has given it to the wrong person. And um, they found out uh, that your doctor had violated um, your privacy or someone in a doctor's office or someone in a hospital or someone in um, a government institution, organization or someone. But this is as if it's a hospital, something to do with hospital, your health, uh, um, your health information is as if this person had uh, access your health information and gave it to someone else and i see they caught this person because they recognize that this person has violated their um, rule of conduct so a lot of you um could be recognizing this so be aware of this okay all right ladies and gentlemen we are going to be looking at the sun people the sun people so these are people who were born 6 a.m. to 6 p.m. All right. So what is going to be happening and transpiring? All right. So the sadness um, is uh, um, the energy of the lovers. And uh, it's like an ex from the past or ex um, um, that you had a child with, ex-husband. Um the divorce a divorce is here and it's as if your ex-husband and the kids work against some of you Libran. however this is coming up and it's transpiring they're going to be recognizing um that an ex from the past have worked against some of you Libran. okay um if you Libran is married to a cancer um, they're going to be finding out that uh, cancer or a scorpion, if you're uh, in a relationship with a cancer or a scorpion or married to a cancer or a scorpion, it's as if a earth sign person is going to be recognizing that uh, you had an affair with this person through the marriage or you were seeing this person through the marriage, but um, information are going to be coming out. And I see uh, your child and their father could be recognizing that you were seeing um this scorpion this married scorpion um through the time of the relationship that you were married or either in a relationship with a taurus Virgo, or a capricorn person because they're going to be recognizing that and it's as if the father and the child is going to be finding out that um this scorpion or this cancer was in the picture even when you were both in a relationship with them. So something is going to be coming out, okay? And they're going to be recognizing and finding out the truth of who is, uh, um, and it's as if your ex is investigating and is looking and is trying to figure out how long you were seeing this person before you become involved with them. I see this is coming up. Now, if some of you are in a relationship with a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn person, they're going to be finding out that this, um, that the child is for it. The, the, um, it's as if, if you were in a relationship, the, the, the father in law, um, do not really like you. Okay. So if you're in a relationship with a scorpion and the father is a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn, they don't like you because they know what you have done to cause um, this scorpion a whole lot of problem. And they know that you were sent in the life of the scorpion and has tried to ruin 
uh, the scorpion and they are going to be now recognizing and seeing exactly what you have done to the scorpion person and how you have created a whole lot of problem for the scorpion person so don't try to if your your father-in-law is a taurus Virgo, or a capricorn or your kid father or your don't reach out to this person because this person is not going to be helping you this person thinks that you have you have ruined their child's life okay in the second week a lot of people are now um seeing who is this taurus virgo or capricorn person so a lot of you, you are now recognizing um, that uh, if you, you know, if you have a relationship with a scorpion or a cancer and their parents or Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn, I don't think that you, these two people are so saddened that you have ruined their child's life. And I would say back away, all right? Whether it's a divorce, whether it's a separation, back away. Because these two people are so sad. Sad over how a situation had transpired with some of you Libran and a Scorpion and a Cancer. And they are so sad. And they don't, you know, so if you, you, you want to connect or apologize to them, let it go. They don't want an apology. They don't want to see you. They just want to let it go and just move forward. They don't want to have anything to do with you. So don't go get pregnant for this person because um, this, this this their family doesn't want to collaborate or have anything to do with you um, because they feel as if you have ruined their child's, child's life and this is coming up. I see they're going to be trying to resolve a situation um, because light has been shed and they recognize why um, uh, your parents or maybe yourself or an older per person was ill. They're now recognizing light is going to be shedding because they're now recognizing um, what was happened to this person else. And I see doctors or, or people are going to be coming together in order to resolve a situation because they recognize that it was uh, taking a tone on someone else's health, especially if you have a sister that is a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn person or your mom that is a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn person, they're having some sort of a health issue and it was created by some sort of a um, stress they were going under. And people are now going to be recognizing um, this is the reason, the stress that this person was going on there. That was what was causing a lot of problem for this person in their lives. And I see truths is going to be revealed. Okay. I see regrets. This is the five of cups. Twice the energy of the five of cups. A lot of you are dealing with a scorpion man. And I see regrets for the scorpion man. The scorpion man is going to be very regretting. The scorpion man is going to be regretting a whole lot of problems. Uh, regretting a situation with his company. Regretting a house. Regretting losing a lot. Regretting. The scorpion man is really now regretting a situation. So... As some sign people, um, you are really dealing with some sort of a, um, in-laws issues that is going to be coming up. And a lot of you are, uh, who are in a relationship, um, with you guys, they, you know, especially Scorpion, they're going to be regretting, uh, ever being involved with you. Because they recognize that you school, you liberals have ruined their lives. And I see some of you, especially um, liberals that was seen a married man, um, uh, they are saddened. The this, this scorpion married man is saddened. I don't know if you ended the relationship or it was ended before this full moon, but they are saddened. And they're kind of like as if uh, I've wasted my time. So regrets, it doesn't have to be a scorpion. It can be a Pisces cancer or a scorpion person. It could be a situation where you two had a relationship. It is over. But this person regrets, you know, 
it's as if this person recognized that, you know, you weren't honest enough with a whole lot of things. And this person is now recognizing that, that you Librans have, you know, choose for your self in order to accommodate certain aspects and situation in your life and i see um they're going to be recognized in this a whole lot of you that have a mother that is a taurus virgo or a capricorn person could be finding out something about you or um if you, you, you you're going to be recognizing that uh, if someone just cuts you off is because they're having some sort of a health issue, some sort of a situation that they're dealing with that they can't communicate with you. So I see truths is going to be coming out about a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn man. And they're going to be seeing the connection between a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn man and woman. And a resolution is going to be coming in to some sort of a health issues that some of you have been having. Um, some of you women could have been having some sort of a health issue and they're going to be trying to resolve this situation because they recognize that some sort of a stress had bring a tone on your um, on your health and they're going to be trying to find some sort of a way to resolve the situation. Regrets. I see a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpion man have a whole lot of regrets and it's as if this person could have been working against some of you a Libran and now they recognize that they were on the wrong side of the fence, okay? And this is it. But it's as if this person is um it's coming up for you guys as it was some sort of a relationship or um some sort of a undesirable uh situation an affair uh you could have divorced this person it could have been a relationship that gone sour um but they you are now recognizing and this person is really um saddened they regret they regret that they had connected with you Libran for whatever the reason is all right so regrets is also coming up for the moon sign people all right um regrets is uh, um what you're coming in this full moon in for the moon sign people so sun sign people and moon sign people um are having regrets okay a whole lot of regrets so so let's see what is transpiring so here it is a lot of you are dealing with um the water sign people Pisces, Cancer, Scorpion person. And this is a young person, younger than 50. And whoever this person is, it could be a child for some of you, could be having some sort of a problem at school. Um, one and two, if it's your partner, some sort of a problem at the workplace or at home. And I see a whole lot of regret. The Scorpion regrets the moment that he has coincided with you Librans because um, somehow if you, this this person had lived with you they wish that they had not have some sort of a rent contract or some sort of a contract in um living with you um so it could be you rented a place together or you moved in together or you buy a house together the scorpion is regretting every moment um so whatever this regret is with the scorpion or with this person there's a whole lot of regrets that is happening um because um this young person so older men um are there but young people for you moon sign people which could be coming up as uh, these are people between the age of 18 and 50 they're regretting a situation all right in the first week, you're dealing with a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpion person at the workplace, or this could be a mother. Some of you, your mother, if your mother is a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpion person, um, um, I see that there is some sort of a problem that she might be going in the, sick, the hospital or there could be some sort of a hospital moment um, is coming up for this person because uh, I see some sort of a changes is happening and some sort of a hospital moment. Um, uh, some of you could be dealing with the Pisces, Cancer, Scorpion woman um, that is a supervisor at the workplace that you're having some sort of a issues with. And it's as if you need to stand your ground and protect yourself from this woman. But it's like an older person. For some of you, maybe it's a sister. 
um you could be sharing house or you could be asking your sister to share a house and uh, you're going to be regretting it or if you know you ask your sister to share a place you're going to be regretting it but let's see how that is going to be okay i see justice justice came down in the second week Justice came down on an older couple. A tower moment is here for an older couple. They're now recognizing what an older couple have done. Uh, some of you liberals could have worked with a older couple to create some sort of issues and problems. And um, a tower moment came down for this older couple because the, um, they found this older couple and it's going to be charging this co older couple of something what they're de doing because the law is here. So some sort of a legal matter with an older couple and a tower moment is coming down because they recognize what an older couple have done. So um, is it your parents? I'm not seeing it as your parents. I'm seeing as uh, some of you could be working personal assistant for an older couple or some sort of a um, situation, but I'm not seeing it not, not as your parents. So it is more of a holder couple that some of you liberals has supported and did something and was working or co co collaborating with this older couple and judgment at all a moment. They recognize that this older couple have created some sort of a criminal crime and justice came up on this older couple. And that's going to be happening in the second week for some of you. So I see this older couple is not going to be winning some sort of a legal suit because they recognize what this older couple have created. Then we are moving forward. Another major event that is going to transpire where a lot of you women are going to be balancing out some sort of a problem um, with your mom. Okay, or with a grandmother or with an aunt, but it's an older person. If you are an older woman, I see you older women are going to want to reconnect and balance out some sort of a situation that you and uh, someone else was having. So it could be um, family issues, uh, issues with your siblings, brothers and sister. But I see a whole lot of you older people are going to be reaching out and it's going to be trying to resolve uh, whatever the problem is with an other um a older person because it's as if you have lost contact with this person and you're going to be looking up this person and is going to be um calling up on this person and it's, it's, it's as if a friend that you have lost contact with you're going to be looking for this friend and recontact with this friend because you want um, to know if this friend is okay. All right. I see now they're going to be recognizing um, that a young Taurus Virgo or Capricorn, whether it is a man, woman, or a child, had lied and uh, falsified some sort of a contract. Uh, whoever this Taurus Virgo or Capricorn person is uh, has access some sort of a data contract uh, and information of a scorpion okay and create some sort of a new contract on the false pretend and they now recognize uh, that this young taurus virgo or capricorn person had lied i see sadness for this person because they're coming down on this person and is really recognizing what this person have done against a family um and uh, how you liberals have worked together against a family and has created a lot of chaos for this family. And uh, um, together, there, you know, it could be your son or your daughter. And you liberals are going to be recognizing that your son and your daughter have created a real horrible, horrible situation. And I see sadness. It's, it's, it's a whole lot of sadness for this person because it's as if they caught this person, they recognize that this person have been accessing um, people data and information, another family data and information on the false pretend, um, saying that they have uh, asked them to do this. So um, the sadness is going to be, if, if, if it's your child, this person is in some serious trouble. Uh, definitely. And I see um, that this person is going to be going to an older person and is going to be asking for help. For some of you, it's a friend. 
um some of you is your child some of you is your friend but the ten of swords is that they recognize that this person had lied and the truth is now coming out um about what this person have done because this person was creating some sort of an illusionary situation all right i do love you guys please like share 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 these videos thumbs up um this is a full moon for the 26th of may i do love you guys please um leave a message like share see what is coming up how it's going to affect you i do love you guys i gotta go namaste